summer staycations, they are perfect for relaxing, rejuvenating, and reuniting with loved ones. So a great getaway has to have plenty of fun, plenty of sun, and great food. And Summers at Weekapaw Resort and Conference Center has it all. Here to share some of their summer recipes this morning, Executive Chef Juan Vasquez Santos, starting off the morning with a delicious favorite, a guest favorite, your fried avocado bites. Right, when we come to visit you, we don't leave without right. <laughs> having a few of those. Right. Good morning to Good you. Morning. Great to How have you, you here. Good. It's good to be here. And wonderful. You rolled out a new menu. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Uh, now in summertime, we need to have something light and fresh for everybody. So we decided to do a little bit of fried avocado bites. Perfect. How do you put these together? Well, basically, you just grab a little avocado and grab a like apple with a smoked bacon. Mm -hmm. I would recommend like a thicker bacon. A thicker bacon uh -huh. because that's going to keep everything nice right. and, and tight and so, flavorful. And then you're going to put a like, medium heat to your saucepan and you're going to fry them just little by little. So when you cut the avocado, do you obviously once you get a good avocado, mm. you wrap it right then? Right. Okay. You can you can cut it probably like four, five pieces, whatever you feel like it. Okay. But I would recommend like a because like that's a, a pretty good size. Right. Okay. So you want to do everything like a bite side. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So once you start getting the golden brown or like a if you really like your bacon like a like a real dark, sure. you know, that you're pretty much good to go. Perfect. I would recommend to use a little skewer. Mm -hmm. Because the, the pan is going to be hot. Now, what did you put in the pan? Is that just, just some a, olive oil? A little bit olive oil. Okay, that's just to heat yeah. them back up. Right, because you don't want to put a lot. Of, also, the bacon is going to yeah. have a lot of a crease. And we don't need to do the bacon ahead of time. The no. bacon needs to be raw yeah, when, it, it, when you raw. wrap the, the avocado. And now, this is one of the many dishes that you serve. This is an appetizer dish, right. but your your summer menu, you've come up with some really creative well, uh, We do have a lot, even a week of the fried avocado entree, oh, which is gonna, it's a stuff with like crab meat or pico de gallo, mm. carne salad, whatever you might like. And also we got a really good seasonal salad. Yes. We got a famous shrimp cabo salad. Mm -hmm. We got a lot of seasonal berries. And these are some, mm. look at these. These are some big, these are huge those, shrimp. Those are the black tiger shrimp. Yeah, I would call this a prawn maybe. I don't know. That's huge. That's a nice size. Right. And you do a fantastic cocktail. We showed that in our um, in our intro. That was beautiful. Right. What is this? This one is a shrimp ceviche. And it uh, has a little different kick because this one has a pico de gallo, has a prickly pear cactus okay. in there. You want to put it together? Sure, Let's yeah. Let's do it. All right, I'll get, your, I'll get your glass back here because I know that uh, you, you need how it. We're It's do all it. about presentation. Correct. I know with you, you, you really want it to be beautiful. We're going to use a little bit there? of tomato juice okay. if you want it. Or you can use even a, a Bloody Mary if Ooh, you feel like a little sweet. kick. Listen to you, Chef Juan, yeah. getting this, all this fancy. One is a, Prickly pear cactus. Okay. A little pico That de gallo. was the prickly pear cactus. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then a peak, some pico. Yeah. So you can do a little bit of avocado. Okay. Now what you want to do is just kind of garnish your martini glass. And get a good, nice size shrimp. That's right. wonderful. Now you, if you want to have a really good quality of the shrimp, try to purchase the black tiger shrimp. Black tiger. The okay. quality and texture, it will be much Yeah. When you go to better. your to the deli section or your seafood section in right. your grocery, make sure you ask for those. So okay. if, if you see it's real simple, mm -hmm. now if you want to spice it up, you can put a little bit of vodka. <gasps> with a Bloody you, Mary. I love this. Vodka, and Bloody Mary. I'm starting to detect right. a theme here. No, oh. it's and perfect. you just finish it a little bit more and you're good to go. Ooh, now, okay. Go ahead. Now, this is the plan. You're going to show us how to make these a little bit later. Thank you right. so much, the fried plantains. So you want to garnish with a fried plantain Chips. So refreshing. Look at that. And that looks much. good. You want to try one? Sure. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. yeah. Now this is just with tomato, right? Right. Okay. Tomato. But you can use Bloody Mary. Right. Uh. Mm. That's mm. delicious. What mm. did you put on the shrimp? Anything? <coughs> <laughs> you got a little bite, right? A little bite. I, I put a little bit of um, lemon juice mm. and kosher salt and That's a little delicious. garlic. Well, cool. the cool thing is Chef Juan shared all of these incredible recipes with you on SonoraLiving.com. But let's give you some information really quickly. Weekapaw Resort and Conference Center, they are located at 10438 North Fort McDowell Road in Scottsdale. Right now, they are offering two summer staycation packages starting at $99 a night. 480-789-5300 or visit WeekapaResort.com to book your reservation. We have Chef Juan all morning, so you're going to get some great recipes still to come.